Hello, sweet team. Welcome back to my channel. This is Sweet Achele. Today, I'm here to share with you all how to prep and store your okra to last for a long, long time and not lose the slime. So here I have four packs of okra that I've poured into this bowl. I shake it to get any leaves or anything that's on it and then I'll transfer it into my sink and I'll give it a good good wash until it is nice and clean. <laughs> International food captain who showed you how to make pizza, jala, mango and okra soup, sushi and pastries. All this and more. Sweet ajele, go go, go go, gaga go. Sweet ajele, go go, go go, go go, gaga go. Sweet ajele. Once it's beautifully washed, transfer it into a tray, and then we're going to begin cutting. After washing, I'm going to go ahead and clip off the tail and the head, which will help me have a smooth cutting once I'm ready to cut it. Whenever you find okra like this, it is no good. Get rid of it because it will break your slime. You will need a freezer safe Ziploc bag like this let's begin we're just going to go ahead and cut it to our preferred shape and size some people like it small others like it big so this is the first method i just give it a rough chop and then i'm going to use the knife to chop through it until i have the size that i prefer The second method is to take the okra, cut it into four pieces without cutting it off completely and then we'll go right ahead and chop it into pieces just like this. I'll then go ahead and put on a glove and transfer the okra into my Ziploc bags. I do that because it is an easier cleanup. It doesn't stick to the glove the way it'll stick to your fingers. It is totally optional. You don't have to do that. I choose to because it makes my life easy. And there you have it, everything is done. So all I'm going to do now is to take out as much air as I can before going ahead to zip it up. And there you have it ready for our freezer and as you can see there is absolutely no air in it so it won't get as much freezer burn as it would if you didn't take out the air transfer it into your freezer and it will last you for over a year without you losing the slime okay whenever you're ready to use this you can bring it out overnight or thaw it in your microwave just like this 
make your hot water add in some baking soda for that extra slime it is optional but we Ghanaians love our okra soups and stews super slimy so we do add in our baking soda or salt peter add in your okra bring it to a boil and check out the slime as if you used fresh okra and this is okra that have been in my freezer for over a year and it did not lose a thing <laughs> thank you all so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and are inspired to try the recipe until i see you in the next one stay safe keep loving each other and remember that the love of god and family is life's greatest blessing and guys bye y'all